All right, I'm going to show a little demo of my Bruin control panel I just built. It's about 90% complete. All right, right here we got a little thermocouple uh, connector. This goes to my boil kettle. All right, there it is. I just have it hooked up right now. I don't have it uh, any heat sources. It's capable of 240 volts. Um, 50 or 5,500 watt um, heating elements and here's a little look at the bottom I haven't he hooked up the heating elements terminals yet here's a little demo of it though flip on my breaker okay got the power going and now the ignition Okay, I only have one thermocouple on. So you can see the other uh, PIDs are a little sporadic. Okay, I've got pump lights, only one of them connected right now to a uh, lamp, and this would simulate a pump. Okay. So the thermocouple's reading about 68 degrees right now. Or sorry, 60 uh 64 degrees. Okay, it's set to heat at 68 and if we take a look inside, we'll see a little light flashing on my solid state relay that's telling it to come on and off and you'd follow those lines down to my um, mechanical relay then to the fuses and then that's where I would send those out to the actual heating elements but I haven't set that up yet for a little while I'm just going to be brewing with the uh, you know just using the temperature sensors and timer um, here's a little look at the inside there's the main power uh, relay and this is all 50 amp so we've got a lot of juice running through here. Here's a look at the back side of the term the, the control panel. Okay, and then got my timers here set. Set for one minute. And start. And this would be my uh, hot liquor tank, mash tun and boil kettle PID and I would only have I only have two heating elements or two kettles that would get hot and that would be my hot liquor tank and my boil kettle and to switch between those or boil kettle turn them off and again no power coming out of there because I don't have it Connect it all the way. Here's my power light. And about 16 seconds, we'll hear a little alarm. And there it goes. Got a little red light, a little red flashing light for my alarm. And it stops after 10 seconds, or I can manually stop it. And it's also got mechanical reset. Sets it back to the uh, three minutes. And that alarm would go off every minute. And there it is. There's the brewing control panel. Again, about uh, 85, 90 percent complete, something like that. Another look at the inside. Never crimped so many terminals in my life. And that's it.